Hey YouTube, this is Southern Prepper One. Yes, I'm an addict. Um, I just bought 27 more file cabinets. And I, I have enough now, so I'm gonna give you this actual site that you can use in your area to find your auctions. This was a school district auction. auction. Um, it's called Proxy Bid. I'll put a link to it so you can just go to it. Um, 27 file cabinets. Now get ready, man. I, I broke the bank on this one. I spent $54, $2 a piece. Now, granted, some were a little bit cheaper and some were a little bit more expensive, but it, it worked out exactly $2 a piece. Um, I have all of these, plus there's 10 more I gotta pick up tomorrow, and I have one lateral one that's not here, it's up at, near the house. But let me explain file cabinets to you. The reason I'm doing it now is because I got all I need. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm selfish. All kinds of different kinds of file cabinets. Um, proxy site, the proxy bid site, uh, you're, uh, to my knowledge, on every site you're allowed to look at what you're buying beforehand. Some auctions, like this one, I did not see it until after the day that they had the inspection. So I bought all these sight unseen other than pictures. So if you can, Get the pictures, fine. If you can go in person, fine. That's even better. You can actually look and see what you want. This one had a lot of prepping items in the sense of a lot of metal. If, if you're in the welding, uh, they had lots of T-posts, uh, a lot of furniture, a lot of stuff went dirt cheap. Literally dirt cheap, like dollar for a nice table. Um, you know, like a, a table for your workshop or a table for the kids to paint on, just really nice stuff. Um, some of the stuff gets so cheap, but file cabinets. So I am good. I have like 90 file cabinets. You might say, Dave, what the heck? You got a problem? No, I don't. Well, maybe I do. But the, the thing is, I have two utility buildings, storage buildings. I have my shop, um, and, and we're building another shop. So my purpose is I want all my stuff organized. I want them where a mouse can't chew on anything. And you cannot beat $2 a piece. You can't even buy a plastic tote. Go buy a plastic tote at Walmart. The cheap things will break at no time. And they're like six, seven, eight, ten dollars I pay $2 a piece for these. I will get organized. I love being organized. It drives me crazy knowing I have something. It's like, where did I put that? Labeling these things, uh, you, 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 it's just wise stewardship. You can buy things, put it up, and it will store better. Uh, you won't be losing it. Uh, it's just a wise use of your money. So many, many reasons why I like them. I've gone over it. Uh, definitely fire protection. It's really hard to start the stuff on fire inside here. If you get a little fire going, it's easier to control it. Also, if you get a water leak and water's coming in, it does offer some protection from leaks. Also offers a lot of protection from a three and a five year old grandson. If they can't see it, they probably aren't gonna get into it. And they like getting into my stuff. They think it's the coolest stuff. Um, so this keeps it hidden. Uh, a lot of times you get keys if not replace the lock and you can really keep your grandkids out of stuff uh, especially things that could be dangerous to them so just i'm not really picky this is a han this is a good brand you can tell this is a lot narrower than this one right here i like the ones but this isn't a showstopper so don't be picky see this goes all the way back so if you have stuff stacked in here it can't fall through a lot of them have these things that are adjustable so really help storing this one i wish it was taller because you can put it in the back but it's still a lot of them are tall enough where you can just slide this totally in the back and then you can stack now there's a lot of good things about buying file cabinets because a lot of times there's stuff in them i'm telling all kinds i have more file folder brand new ones than i'll ever need i throw them away now uh, it's unbelievable some good stuff in this one look at that <coughs> toilet paper bags paper towels all kinds of material all kinds of stuff are left in these file cabinets so really you could get an awesome surprise so uh, 27 file cabinets for $54.
I have no excuse why I am not super organized. None. After this, my wife thinks I'm crazy, um, but she likes it. She actually does. If she had to admit it, she loves them, uh, especially after I get these in place and get the proper labels on it. Uh, I'm gonna use it for all kinds of stuff. Like we got life preservers and, and swimmies for the kids. They're gonna find a home in a couple of these drawers. Um, so everything has a place and, and that's key to being a wise steward of your money and, and prepping. Cause in an emergency, you need to grab stuff. You need to use it. And, and if you, you think, oh, I got that. And I've, I've talked to people and I've done it myself. You're working on a project and you know you have that gizmo or that part that would just make it better and you can't find it this way i can find it and that will really i'll save money because i won't have to run to the store and oh i knew i have it but i can't find it so i gotta buy another one so i'm gonna list the link get looking you can get really organized and that's the key to putting stuff back for the future and prepping thanks for watching